dogs lick us is because they know we have bones inside. <laughs> oh, they're just onions. Like a, like a human tootsie pop. They're just oh, no. trying to get to the tasty <laughs> sound. Oh. So you can never really know what dogs are thinking. Yeah. But at least you can know what we're thinking when we go around the room <laughs> and ask each other, what's on your mind? Yeah. Starting with Brooke. Brooke, what's on your mind? Well, guys, I signed up for a pottery class. Oh. Which, yeah, is awesome. That is fine. Why, why are you looking confused? Yeah, no, awesome is a word that you could use to describe <laughs> it. Pottery sounds cool. So I go to my very first class this week, mm -hmm. and we are using a wheel, and it is really exciting for me because mm -hmm. I've always wanted to do this. Oh, one of those wheels that spin and yeah, yeah, pottery wheel. Cool. So, so I'm building this bowl, and I'm like, oh nice. my god, it looks good. Oh, okay. you're like a bowl. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Like, oh my god, I'm so talented. Yeah. I just, <laughs> Open your own Etsy store soon. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm really proud of this bowl. And now all I have to do is get it off the wheel and move it so that okay. it can dry. Okay. So it's done. So you use these big, like, metal things, and I'm picking it up. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And as soon as I pick it up, the whole thing folds inward. Oh. It was so sad, you guys. And no. I felt like a little child with a destroyed, like, piece oh. of artwork. And I went over to the teacher, and I'm like, can I... Can I fix it? I was just going to ask, can yeah. you fix it? Like, no. Oh. That's it? Oh. Seem to bring home like a sad, saggy bowl? Nope. Now i got to start over. I have to go in on my off time oh, so that wow. I'm now caught up with the class. Wow. Same pottery's hard. Oh, you're behind. Yeah, now I'm behind <laughs> in the class. Now I have to go in during the practice hours because I had to get up. Oh, Sounds like it's worth yeah. the $80 a month yeah. or whatever you're paying. Yeah, this better be a nice bowl. Yeah. Well, I'm just expensive. telling you, you guys are all going to get some real bad pottery for any sort of person. Hey, I like all forms of pots. I've yeah. just heard dogs over bowls. <laughs> Jose, what's been on your mind? Well, if you guys didn't know, I bought a new car uh, a little over a year ago. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. And it's my first, like, nice car. It has electric locks. Oh, it has AC that works. Like, it's mm -hmm. really nice, right? And when I bought the car, they assigned me a salesperson that says that, quote, they take care of all the celebrities. Oh, She's like, oh. listen, I'll football coaches and players in the area oh, that she wow. like, sells to. She's like okay. a celebrity specialist. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you not have very many celebrities coming <laughs> <Yeah. into that. laughs> The local radio yeah. guy, right? Yeah. But they're making me feel special. And at the end of the purchase, she's like, now you get this VIP sticker on your car, oh, okay. which means you stand out, you get free car washes, wow. you get uh, priority when it comes to the service department. Okay. So if there's a okay. huge line, they'll skip me to the front. Wow. Yes. Yes. Whatever. All the other customers must hate your car. Right. right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking, Pulling up. And I'm like, this is a way to schmooze me. Like, you got your sale. Let's do this, right? So recently, I take my car to the dealership mm -hmm. to get my tires rotated. And you're like, VIP. Yeah. Me. Well, I make my appointment. I pull up. They take my keys. So while okay. I'm waiting, I have a cup of coffee. And I'm BSing with some of the service guys. And I'm like, hey, so I'm dying to know, like, how much do you have to spend on a car to get the VIP sticker? How do you get into my club? Yeah, yeah like, yeah. if you're not a celebrity, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. what do you need to spend? And he's like, everyone has a VIP sticker. Oh. oh. I go, what? what? And then he goes, literally anyone that buys any car here gets a VIP oh. sticker. <laughs> I'm like, wait, what? Oh. And he's like, yeah, it's our thing. It's just like oh. your tag that you bought it here. So and you're not really it. getting priority. You're no. just getting in line. You're <laughs> Me. He's a man feel good. That's not VIP, it's EIP. Equally important. Yeah, I know. God, right. And you're like talking about it. I know. Oh, oh, so cringy. Well, Alexis, <laughs> tell us what's been on your mind. Uh, so, okay, um, ever since I went to Europe, I've been hunting for this like certain type of boots. Just like black combat style boots, yeah. okay? okay. Mm -hmm. Just because everyone had them there, and I'm like, they're stylish, you know? Got mm -hmm. it. Then I noticed Brooke had a pair of them, okay? Oh, she does. Oh, and, oh, and oh, Brooke, you know, one day Brooke gave me the details on where she got them and stuff and all yeah. that. And it happened. I bought the same pair of boots as Brooke. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, no. Do you need more fashion? No, I'm you guys are basically now. dressed the same today. Yeah. Big black I mean, sweater, no, blue no. jeans. It's all different, except this, I have to admit, I did copy from Brooke. Yeah. <laughs> I never nice. thought I'd see the day. Me either. Copy so, Brooke. I know, and I actually really like them. So Good. wait, because yeah. you both are wearing them, are they cool or are they not cool? I don't oh, know anymore. You I guys are cool. Has Why to don't decide? you just accept that I'm cool? <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you yeah. this one thing is okay. Everybody
everybody knows that all the really cool people show. I'm cool. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's got me for being cool. And, and I'm behind him. Yeah, and I'm a VIP. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm cool. Wow. All right, Jeffrey, what's on your mind? Well, I'm not cool, and I uh, never should have went to the grocery store over the weekend. Why? Because uh, uh, they know me over there now. Okay, well, that's I fine. I frequent though. that store, especially the people in the toiletries aisle. They're very familiar I, with me. Uh, but I definitely <laughs> should not have gone right after my dentist appointment. Oh, because your mouth was all numb? I, I had a procedure done. They numbed me yeah. up. But I felt like they did more anesthesia than they normally do. Okay. Because my whole left side of my mouth oh. was... I couldn't feel it for oh, hours after great. the procedure. Yeah. That's the worst because you can like bite your cheek or your oh tongue and not even feel it. My mom used to always make us go to the drinking fountain so that she could watch <laughs> us dribble and laugh. No, it's not a great look, but I decided to hit the store on my way home from the dentist and I'm yeah. at the checkout and the cashier goes, so what are you doing the rest of the day? It's kind of nice out. And I was trying to say... Yeah, I'll probably go for a walk in the park with my dog. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Very but with my dumb, numb mouth, it came out like, yeah, I'll probably go to the park in the dark with the dog. You were right there having a stroke. I know, and they were like, uh, probably thinking like, oh, he, he's different. You're drooling all over yourself. Yeah. So I immediately decide I'm not going to speak for the rest of our interaction, yeah. which oh, is no. equally as weird. Yeah. And you're just, just like talking. nodding. You're like, mm-hmm. Now it looks like you're like, no, 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 I sent you money. <laughs> That's exactly how I felt. So now I'm going to have to go back to that store and face no. that cashier again. Oh, no. Jeffrey, at this point, you need to go to self-checkout. For yeah, real. Dude, especially. Is that where the cool kids go? Yeah. All the cool <laughs> kids check themselves in. But text in to 78592. Tell us what's been on your mind. That's what's on ours. It's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning.